Yo, what's up, crazy? It's me, Crazy Nonk, and I just wanted to make a, a video on the live reaction of the Multiverses Q&A, and then after that is me going over it more in detail of the big changes that we at least got and all the information. So I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoy. I'm gonna tell Kirkland that I love this goddamn jerky meat. Wait, announcements. Oh shit. Whoa! Dev team has to answer your question then no. What? I don't have access. Are you happy waiting? Are you happy waiting, huh? Huh? I think so. There it is. Boom. Superman. First one, baby. First one. Come on. Upvote. Yeah. <laughs> Let the upvotes go off the charts. That's what I'm talking about. It's like waiting for your crush to message back. You don't know if she's going to message back. Yeah, it's kind of underwhelming, isn't it, Breeze? You know what? I could have been sleeping right now. With that said, I'm not playing multiverses ever again. <laughs> yeah, I really wish they were ta talking. I feel like this is just like, you know, we just got phones. We just texting just got created. And we're trying to text. It's kind of ridiculous. At least have the messages like pre-typed out, you know? How will a parry interact with an armored attack? I don't know. What are you guys' guesses? What are you guys' guesses? My guess is it will break his armor. Parry an armor to an opponent, it will break their armor. Yes! I called it. See, I'm smart. This is a this is why you can rely on me, Crazy Knock, big forehead, number one Superman player, for your news. And next up, we have Crazy Knock! One of the best questions we've ever had in this Discord channel. We want to send him a set of multiverses cards. We want to fly him out to the headquarters. And we want to give firm handshakes, sign signatures want him to play test the game because these questions were so good true three questions in 20 minutes you're right holy shit no way it's been 20 minutes okay bro oh my god someone did a <laughs> someone like did a freaking super <laughs> reaction of a clown i'm <laughs> okay oh my god uh, i'm sorry i shouldn't laugh at that that is uh that is too far guys come on now with respect i'm at a possible why would you not do a like twitch live stream i want the the rick and morty map where i can interact with the plumbus the plumbus you can't freaking do that to my cheeks <laughs> yeah dude if i get hit by a stretchy punch that long you bet your ass i'm gonna <laughs> But uh, great question. Holy shit! Type! I don't want to see typing. Typing. I feel quite passionate about this one. Superman. Design and push really. Goddamn. Quit typing, Ajax, with your goddamn eyeballs. I'm trying to highlight as we go. Corey hit the nail right on the head. All I will say is buckle up, buttercups. Thanks, Grant. I will uh, play the game how I please, and I won't be buckled up, and I am not your buttercup. Hello? Schism. I was excited that you were calling me for a second. Corey hit the nail right on the head. You know what? It feels like you guys are hitting me right on the head. <laughs> Punk! America, baby. Let's go. Come on. Let's vote for America. De plop. De plop plop. This is a good question from plop plop. So does your character level still need to be level eight plus to equip a full set of perks? No longer need to be level eight. You need to be level 25. Res lives is typing. Ladies and gentlemen, the anticipation is running hot, but can I hold in my hot diarrhea before he answers? I don't know. I might have to get the diaper on. Look at that Superman at the highest emo. We love Superman, buff Superman. Will he be buffed? Oh no, he looks like he stopped typing. He's thinking about it. Wait, wait. Can I say that, John? Is that allowed? Uh, no, no, don't say it, don't say it, don't say it. Holy shit, be careful. Okay, okay, uh, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I won't, uh, can, I, can I tell him the other thing? Oh, absolutely. Eric typing back for Now it's Nakat, he's taking over. I don't think I'm at liberty to just talk about all specifics yet, but perks have been updated in a big way. Woo! That's it, they're changing the big way. That's it. God damn. Whoa! I need to keep my cool. Guys, I'm getting hot. How can I keep my cool when I'm wearing a sweater? Question from Jojo. Jojo, that better be good. Come to the decision for a parry battle mechanic added rather than a block button. Where are the questions? Where is the live Discord? Where is it? I have to wait for it. I have to wait for it, please. It's worse than my crush not messaging back. 
please type something. We're waiting for a response. Multiverses, we want your responses tonight, today, not tomorrow. So could you just type? I'm getting real sleepy. <laughs> Very big. Very big. I love the pair idea. Customization options for scoreboard, cooldowns, character outlines, and other settings will be all returning from beta. Oh, thank God. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. I was worried. I was worried. You guys, it's hot. Guys, that's coming off. They said this was going to be like an hour long, and it's already freaking 50 minutes. Insane, dude. They could have gotten through like 20 more questions if they just did this live. Dude, let me. You're from characters. Oh my God! Sorry, excuse me. Did you stay on this? Okay. Yep, that's what's gonna happen to me if I if they don't answer my question. Yep, we've already knew this. We've already known we've already knew this. Yep, the Discord's bug, I hear a slight hissing sound. A slight Whoa! <laughs> Excuse him, is that you breaking the glass? I swear, what the hell is going on? Everyone hold your butts, dude. This is the one I was hoping to get answered this entire time, finally. Let's go! Oh my God, Batman made Ash. Do you acknowledge that we are so glad to be back? Oh, yes! Do they answer it? Yes! Legend has it, they are actually answering these questions before the shutdown of multiverses. They're just barely getting them out. <laughs> Final question for today's QA form. Oh my God. Which out of the current rosters? Oh my God. Oh my God. Holy shit. <laughs> that was a little overreaction, I'm sorry. That was a little... <clears throat> are you kidding me? We'll see what Bugs is saying. The, the window is getting smaller and smaller. We got to get some news, right? Cool, cool, cool. Then they talk. They finally talk. Oh, my God. So high. Developer video. Cool, 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 cool. He's cool. going off. He's losing it. He's having a meltdown. Oh, oh my God. Oh, yeah. New character. Is it possible? Buttercup is coming. You know, cool, 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 cool. Come on. Let me hear it, yeah, Bugs. Let me hear it. Peel the banana. First thing that was good, a piece of information, though, from Courage. Asked about the armor. You know, the armor spam. It was hard to deal with. Some characters didn't have enough armor break and whatnot but the responses was armor changes were a big focus for the team armor now uses some defense meter and startup has been looked at for the moves that use them there's also more characters that have an armor breaking move or multi-hit attacks so like shaggy kicks in the air that'd be an example of a multi-attack that can successfully challenge armored moves so it seems like the armor is going to just be like less spammy, longer time for the armor to start up on your kit and every character, you know, with the uh, included dash attacks, we might even see even more attacks that are multi-hit or armor break. Another question that was asked, will the blast zones be adjusted to the larger character scale? So the blast zone of the map, uh, the outer edge, the outer arena, because the characters are bigger, the maps are probably bigger. And they basically just said it has been adjusted for the 1v1 and 2v2 because 1v1 is going to be a smaller maps, 2v2 is bigger. How will a parry an armored attack? If you parry an armored opponent, it will break their armor. But if you parry an opponent from a long range, it will bring them closer to you. So I assume like a, you know, up tilt Jake with the axe or maybe his stretchy arm punch. If you parry it, it might like kind of suck him towards you. Suck him in! Get a suck him in! Just... Ah, ah. Oh, oh, oh. oh, make sure to hydrate it today, crazies. Stay hydrated, that's a big thing with me! Can you parry projectiles? I thought that would be a long range attack, but it doesn't seem like it. If you parry it, it will destroy it. There's a perk called clear the air. If you're wearing that and you parry a projectile, it will reflect it instead. So I wonder if you could freaking rep uh, parry Jerry and then Jerry would become mine. I would parry it and it would reflect at him and then he would bounce to the ground and then I, I, Jerry would be the one I could control. It would be mine and I wouldn't give him any G's. Also with stages, they're just wondering about the hazards and whatnot. It's no longer going to be uh, turn off hazards, turn on hazards copy and paste competitive and casual maps they're creating maps with the casual 
uh, mode in mind and also the competitive mode in mind so there's gonna be like probably a lot more fun stuff to interact with silly fun q okay we love this silly q we got a little, little, little of the silly q isn't that right jeff i love the silly q i hope there's a q where they can, they can, you can just beat the shit out of me <laughs> And they also include Easter eggs and surprises on the more casual map. So that'll be fun. A lot more depth. What about the perk changes? Is it going to be different? The perks have been updated in a big way. Clear the air about reflecting projectiles. It seems like there's going to be a lot more perks added in that affect your gameplay. To where you can actually strategically like pick those perks that really matter. And then he's asking if you will have like uh, perks or you have to like re-earn them. Because you have to unlock them. It says you always have access to at least one full set of perks. No customization for the camera zoom in. So we'll see how that is on launch. Breeze was asking what changes the company expect to character movesets, attack speed changes, hitboxes, complete moveset revamps. When they rebuilt the game from Unreal Engine 5, they built the netcode and they tuned the characters to the netcode and like just, they probably retuned every character some way, some form. Also adding on to that, the thing that stands out the most is that time to kill has decreased with the introduction of some past moves now being able to kill. Because before you would have moves that like just did not kill, very difficult, they would just keep bouncing in and out. So that is that is a huge thing as well. And the last but not least, they're asking what their favorite characters were. Oh, that new thing might just end up in the game. Someone who said, oh, buckle up, Buttercup, which is one of the characters from Powerpuff Girls. Wonder Woman has been my favorite. There's also another. So they're just, you know, teasing possibly Powerpuff Girls or at least another character on launch. Overall, the QA could have just been a blog post. I think they could have answered a lot more questions. Like one of the questions, how, do you acknowledge that we are so glad you're back? And that's the question they answer. So there's just things that a QA is designed for and I don't think it's designed for that. Reese lived. I don't know how to say that guy's name, but he did tweet out saying like, oh, next time we'll do it live because this was an awful experience. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, two hours for them to answer 18 questions and half of them were just, they're just kind of whack. Hopefully they learn from that and I just can't wait for release. That's what are, where it's really going to shine crazy. That's where it's going to matter the most. That's a hold on, hold on. Just a few more weeks, man. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. Let's go, crazies. Let's go. I love you, crazies. Goodbye, crazies. I love you. Oh.